place where a family in Denderu, Kiembu County, has decided to hold a virtual burial after Getro's hospital re refused to release the body of their 13 year old daughter who succumbed to leukemia. The family, family only managed to raise 4 million shillings out of the required 18 million shilling bill. Kete News Grace Courier is following up on this story and now joins us live with an update. Grace, a sad, sad situation for this family. What more can you tell us? With Michelle, a sad afternoon here at Ndenderu, uh, specifically the St. Stephen's Gatwikira Church, where <coughs> they're calling it a memorial service. Michelle is happening, and uh, it's not your usual memorial service, because here we don't have a body. Michelle, as you speak, the body is that uh, sent uh, at the Gatrick Hospital in uh, Mosaica. And of course, as you rightly said, Michelle, the family is hoping to raise uh, enough money to be able to secure the body for burial, which they were hoping to actually be today, but they are now uh, planning for a burial on uh, Friday. The Del Michelle stands at 17.9 million shillings. We understand they have been able to pay about 4 million, 600,000 being from the NHIS, and of course the other money being uh, from a fundraising ceremony, which they actually held this Sunday. Now, they had planned for this ceremony earlier on, Michelle, but they planned for it uh, knowing that, you know, Brian, the, the name of the boy is Brian Kimani Njoroge, they will be planned for it knowing that Brian will recover and, of course, they will pay the bill and come back home with him. But, of course, they unfortunately had to carry on with the uh, fundraising ceremony with uh, Brian's body being in the mortuary. He passed on on the 29th of February and today is 11th, uh, Michelle, that's more than 10 days. Uh, at uh, Gatrud Hospital, <clears throat> the family hoping to have him, but of course that has not been uh, able to happen so far. Michelle, the boy suffered uh, from leukemia, that is blood cancer. Yet again, the country losing uh, uh, someone out of uh, cancer, this cancer scourge, and of course that has come out loud, uh, loud here at the memorial service because uh, they say that they have tried all means to raise funds for this boy, but so far that has not been successful, Michelle. Um, it has been an emotional memorial service. I mean, I've been to many, Michelle. In fact, last week I was at a burial ceremony of a close kin, but this one is, is really emotional, Michelle. I mean, we are used to having a body here, but it is not the case, Michelle. So basically, the family hopes to be able to raise the remaining should be about 14 million shillings mm -hmm. so that they can bury the body of uh, Brian uh, Kimani Joroge, a 13 year old boy who was really jovial. You can tell from all the pictures that we've seen here. Oh. He actually did uh, had recorded a song by the name Yesu Mastawangu, and uh, he sang the song with his small brother. He was the first born in a family of uh, four children. And the small bro did present that song. And you could just put the emotions. I remember particularly when a cousin of his who took care of him during the last days paid her tribute to him, uh, just remembering this boy who actually, Michelle, uh, was one who was encouraging the cousin, yet he's the one who was ill. So basically, uh, the family hoped to raise the funds that I needed in order to bury the young boy on uh, Friday. Michelle. All right, many thanks. It is a uh, Grace Courier.